So to be fair, when I started in the roofing industry, the person that owned the company is a very, he's a very nice person, very inspiring. And I followed him and that's what I do. If I, I follow, yep. if I work for him, I'm going to follow you. Yeah. And then when things fell out, I started doing a lot of research and I saw that there's a right way. There's a proper way, like anything in life to do, to build a roof. You know, for example, before that I was in the mattress industry, there's a lot of mattresses that are built incorrectly. So I found that the only way to build a roof are seven stages. The first stage is a clean deck. Now that is the big, the biggest thing about what we do is that most companies, and I don't have an exact statistic. The only thing I know is what I saw and what I experienced. And I've seen thousands of roofs built here in the FW. Most companies don't go down to the deck. So if you don't go down to a clean deck, nothing else you do matters. Okay. So let's say you put ice and water shield, you're putting it incorrectly. It's supposed to be on the deck. You're using synthetic felt. Okay, great. But you don't know what's going on in the deck. What if it's broken and rotten? You're replacing vents. Okay, that's fabulous. But if the attic is in shambles, you don't know anything about it because you're, no, you're not going down to the deck. I mean, I can go on forever. Shingles. Yeah. Yeah. You can yeah. install the most expensive shingles in the market. They're going to look fabulous. What's going to happen? Blisters everywhere. There's an area here in DFW called South Lake. Beautiful homes. There's more blisters than... I've seen in my life because these are massive roofs that are not properly ventilated because whoever built them did not build the roof properly. So another thing that we talk about, you know, it's not advertised on the seven stages, but I may, I'm going to make sure your roof is ventilated properly. A roof is not only shingles. So if I build a hundred square roof and I put two turtles, oh, good for me. I'm an asshole. <laughs> so the seven stages is something I guarantee. And yeah. we, we were not paying for anybody involved in the job, and this is very known here, unless the seven stages are proven. And it's not just a nice fancy shot on one slope. You need to show me the story of the build. I don't care if it's videos. I don't care if it's pictures. Because at the end of the day, if, if I promise a customer something and I, I wasn't at the build and now the roof is ready, I want to be able to show that to the customer. You know. So you're starting with a clean deck, right? Yes. And then you're moving on. Ice and water shield. Okay, synthetic felt, starter strip, drip edge, shingles, ventilation. Okay, so now we have your seven and, stages. And, and before we, we continue, one major thing as well, because people, they can combat me all day. Let's say another company does seven stages. Uh, do you know how to install drip edge correctly? Now, most people don't, okay? Most people take the drip edge on the eaves and they put it over the felt. That's incorrect. And on the rigs, they do it the other way around. So it's not only about seven stages, it's about doing it correctly. You know, correctly. if I see proper a roof, order. yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. It, yeah. okay, I go down to the deck. Now I can do the other six stages, but what did I do on the deck? I had a rig deck we did, I'm pretty sure yesterday, where, you know, we're repairing one, we're repairing the second. I was like, okay, we need a rig deck. Now I could still honor my seven stages, but I'm compromising the most important part of the whole thing. Yeah. So, so that's what I want everybody to remember is that seven stages is great, but make sure it's done correctly every single time. Every you know, single we, stage is done correctly. Every time. Yeah. It has yeah. to. And yeah. the way we guarantee it, because words are, are, are nice and all, we have a W2 employee, a project hero at the job site from start to finish. If he goes to pee, they stop the job. <laughs> that's how we do it. <laughs> 